Dr. Liamp is hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. It's a great pleasure having you here. Thank you. And so Sinera is a, is a company based in Germany and they make uh, materials for OLEDs. So could you tell us more about what makes you different from everybody okay. else? Yeah, sure. We are developing um, iridium-free OLED materials. Um, these materials show the TADF mechanism, which means that they have uh, the delayed fluorescence as a mission principle. And uh, this differs uh, to uh, conventionally used materials like phosphorescent materials. So why is there a need to replace iridium? Why, why do it? If it works well. Um, because our material is based on copper, which is more abundant than uh, iridium. Okay. So iridium is a really rare uh, metal. Okay. So, yeah, I think um, abundance okay. is a uh, okay. key factor. So you think that in the long term your materials will become more cost effective because iridium will, will there will be less iridium in the world? Um, so this is an advantage of our material that it's uh, more available, yes. but at the end the market will, will uh, define the price, I yes. think. So I cannot um, uh, give you guarantee that uh, uh, this yes. will be a an, an yes. cheap yes. answer to, to all the... But in terms of performance, how do you compare with what is already out there on the market? Oh, for example, our green emitting um, device. Oh, I can show you some, yes. some slides. Um, wait, I will just have to search. Ah, um, this is our racket device, for example. This is our racket device, uh, which, is, uh, which has been built at the University of Florida at uh, Professor Frankie Sow's group, um, our, our collaboration partner. And it's just a really simple device stack architecture and it just performs out, uh, uh, or just performs the same um, way like phosphorus and materials do. So um, there's no lack in efficiency. What about lifetime? People always ask me questions about the lifetime of sure. materials. Yeah, lifetime becomes important if a uh, material should uh, get into. Um, and devices. So, um, since this is a solution processed uh, material or material designed for solution processing, there is a gap to uh, compare to um, vacuum processed uh, materials. Thus, um, we have to work on it to uh, bring it to a more stable level. Yes. And how far along are you in terms of commercializing your products? I know you are recruiting many people these days. Yeah. So at the moment, our stage is that we uh, give away uh, samples for testing, yes. also at uh, potential customers later on. So um, uh, we, we, will we will receive uh, their answers and their uh, new requirements, and we try to adopt this. And uh, yeah, we are developing together with the partners from industry. But do you plan on manufacturing in volume, or are you looking for a partner scale um, for scaling up? I I cannot give a detailed answer okay. to this question. Um, both, both things uh, or both opportunities are uh, possible, possible, so it depends. Possible. And how has the show been so far for you? Um, there was great interest uh, for us uh, this morning, so uh, I was uh, quite busy with my colleague. We were talking all the time and I didn't have the time to go around, so uh, hopefully I will do it uh, later on. And, uh, Very good. We'll, give you well, thank you again. It's great to have you here. Thank you very much. And uh, thanks for the interview. Thank you.